Also new tonight, a mystery in the air in one Hamilton County neighborhood. People believe something is falling from the sky and ruining their valuables. Yeah, no one seems to know for sure where it's coming from. News 8's Richard Essex went to Noblesville to investigate. There are rust spots developing on cars. Anything outside that has metal on it is developing rust spots. There is something falling from the sky in this older Noblesville neighborhood, and the people that live here want action. Austin Riker took me on a quick tour around the outside of his house this afternoon. Everything around the house is coated with this odd, sticky metal flake. He and his fiance have tried cleaning this stuff off, and it doesn't seem to come off easy or at all. Our stuff's being ruined. Everything we've invested our money into this summer is being ruined. My truck's paint job's ruined. Her truck, her vehicle's ruined. Several months ago, they noticed a gritty film developing on everything outside. They had stopped eating out of their garden and spent most of their time at home indoors. Obviously, we want to start planning to have children. I, to be totally honest, I do not want to bring children into this if they're going to have to breathe that in. Riker bought this truck two years ago. It's his first new vehicle. He takes very good care of this truck. He ran a business card across the hood. It sounds like there is sand ground into the paint. Their neighbor has the very same problem. To me, it looks like it's some sort of a uh, burn mark, some sort of like rust discoloration that's burned into the paint. It doesn't seem like it's normal tree sap or pollen or some kind of environmental thing. It seems like something burned into it and kind of just won't go away. According to a statement sent to News 8 by the Indiana Department of Environmental Management, there have been others to file complaints. Last Tuesday, a state air quality inspector tested the air and found no evidence or violations related to dust coming from a nearby facility. The inspector did, however, find a record-keeping violation at that same facility. But the guy I spoke with that works there said that they've known about the issue for months now. IDEM says they will continue to monitor a facility close by Reichert's house, and they encourage others to report suspicious dust or uncontrolled emissions.